Hello and welcome back to my channel everyone. Today I will be showing you my Japan Airlines Boeing 777-300ER. Okay, so first, this model is kind of like a self-build kit, but I've just built it up already, so yeah, it's really, really beautiful. It's kind of like a Hazegawa kit, but you don't really need to do anything. The uh, the fuselage is already is already pre-made. You just snap fit a few things in, but you still have to do the decals. So it's kind of like the Hazegawa kits. And there's also a little stand that you can put on. Just the regular stands like that. Put the stand up. And here is the plane. So, yeah, this model is pretty beautiful, but there's a few defects. So remember to watch to the end. Okay, anyways, first the nose here. You can see a little, um, like that little, I don't know how to call that. It's like a little, cr it's like a crater, but it's on the model, so. I, I wouldn't really say this is a model, it's just a toy, I would say. But it's still pretty uh, delicate too. And it actually still looks like one, so. Yeah, it's, it, it is like a model, but yeah, kind sort of, kind of. Yeah, the nose landing gear is just like that. It's not even rollable or something like it. Gemini Jets model. It's in one of four hundred scale, but the box says it's one of five hundred. I actually still have the box here. I'll show you. Just give me a sec. Okay, so apparently I threw it away, but uh, I still have the plastic covering here. This is the plastic. Yep, it's right here. If you can see. Oh, gosh. So, yeah, it's it's a nice model. So, the box says it's one of 500, but it's really just one of 400. So, yeah, anyways, there's no registration. Well, at least there's no on the front, but there is on the tail. Okay, but... Uh, anyways, here are the Japan Airlines titles, as you can see. L1 door, cockpit windows, the business class area, uh, or first class, um, L2 door, L3, the middle one. The wings are pretty basic. They're just like that. No winglets, because the 777 doesn't need winglets. It's just that big. The engines are just uh, super tiny. They can't... Uh, even move well one of 400 uh engines don't even move at all so uh yeah just usual stuff or one of 400 yeah one of 400 but the landing gears do not roll so yeah just as i said before they do not roll l4 and l5 door it's really just a plain livery yeah there's the unisife thing. I'm not sure what that is. And then this decal is really weird. It's like backward or something. Because like on the other side, it's the right one. But right here, it's like backwards or something. So J047 or something. Yeah, it's not really supposed to be like that. It's just... The opposite side, as you can see from the other side, it's just like that. Okay, but anyway, anyways, this is the um, uh, horizontal stabilizer. The vertical stabilizer is here. It's actually pretty detailed, as you can see. Yeah, it's really detailed. There's all those marks. And unfortunately, I accidentally bended my vertical horizontal stabilizer a bit and this model is a little bit not straight because of the stand but yeah so i accidentally bended it thanks to my grandpa for making it uh 
a little bit more straightened, but this other side is a lot better. That one was, that side was not bended, but as you can see, if it'll focus, focus, okay, yeah, so there's the details, thing. but yeah, I think this model is okay. Because it's not really a model. There's not really like the det details and it's a plastic one. One 400 models are usually die cast. But yeah, here's the slats. The wings are pretty detailed, just like a uh, model. But over here, the black lines are the one I I did I painted on because um, the decals just broke. They were really, really bad, so. I just used my paint marker, but my paint marker somehow got through. I used the tape, but it's still just somehow like that. It just, yeah, it's kind of hard to, t it's kind of hard to say, but yeah, the tape just entirely didn't do anything that I was hoping for. But anyways, this model is really, really cool. I wouldn't say it was a model, but you can do butter landings like that pretty nicely because it didn't ha doesn't have gear tilt, so it will stay up pretty long, if you can see. Okay, but yeah, this model is really, really nice. I mean, toy, because yeah, you know, it's not really a model. It's just a toy. But there is a few bad parts, but yeah, this model, I mean, toy is pretty nice still. So yeah, if you guys have any thoughts, please comment it down in the comments down below, right down there. And so I'll see you guys in my next video. So remember to stay tuned. Bye.